President Obama has pledged to keep the White House a no-smoking zone. The president says he quit smoking cigarettes, but in, de in a December interview, he admitted having fallen off the wagon at times. What can he do to kick the habit once and for all? NJN News health and medical correspondent Sarah Lee Kessler sought advice from ex-smokers and experts. I, Barack Hussein Obama, do solemnly swear. President Obama has inherited what some say is the toughest job in the world, an economy that's in shambles, mounting job losses, and wars on two different fronts. These problems are national priorities, but a personal priority for the president is winning his purported two-decade-long battle with nicotine. You'd be hard-pressed to find a photo of Obama smoking a cigarette, but there are lots of cartoons, including this one, highlighting the link between presidential job stress and the urge to light up. People tend to feel that if they're feeling stressed and they reach for a cigarette, then it makes them feel a little bit better. But in reality, what's going on, for the most part, is that you're treating your withdrawal symptoms. Dr. Mark Steinberg is a psychologist with the Tobacco Dependence Program at UMDNJ's School of Public Health in New Brunswick. He says there's a good reason it's so tough for smokers, including Obama, to quit. There's 4,000 different chemicals uh, when a cigarette is lit, and they all work in synergy to maximize uh, the addictive nature of cigarettes. Websites like New Jersey QuitNet and Quit Center support groups maximize the probability of success. They help these women and this man kick decade-long smoking habits. You just got to concentrate on the things that do cause the trigger. You just have to be committed that you can't have one, not one puff. And you're going to crave whether you smoke or not. Addiction experts want President Obama to know that when a nicotine craving strikes, it often passes within five minutes, whether you light up or not. When he wants a, a cigarette, he can have a pretzel stick, he can have a carrot stick, he can have a piece of candy in his pocket. Smoking cessation aids like these are helpful. Obama was often observed on the campaign trail chewing Nicorette gum. But according to this little girl, the daughter of an ex-smoker, President Obama has two good reasons to quit, Sasha and Malia. They don't want to their dad to die. That's bad. Besides, he's a president. You don't want the president to die. So maybe next time Sasha gives dad a thumbs up, it'll be because he's won the battle against the leading cause of preventable death. Sarah Lee Kessler, NJN News, New Brunswick.